Hi guys, so I have a book haul for you, uh, for you, and I don't have many books here, and I'm actually not buying that many books lately, um, and I'm kind of surprised by that. When I went to the bookstore, I was like, I actually picked up Beautiful Creatures, and I'm like, okay, I'm going to get this up and wanting to read it for like a while, and then I end up setting it back down and then not end up getting it, because I'm just going to check it from the library. I've been kind of like changing as a reader, I guess. I used to... At first, I used to be one of those readers that used to check everything from the library, and I had a small small book collection, and then I started becoming one of those um, readers that just wanted to buy the books to expand the book collection. But now, I did a book cleaning, I got read over 100 books, and it was just crazy, and went down from like around 700 books to 570 books, and I know I still have a lot of books, 570 is still a lot. But I did go through a drastic change and also um, realized I didn't close my um, closet door. Oops. Um, also, I don't know, it's like when I go to a bookstore, I'm like, I don't feel like spending money on anything. It's like, I don't know. And I used to be obsessed with buying books and I don't, I guess I'm just changing, I guess. So, so you might not see many book hauls for me anymore. Sorry. But I'll try to do something else, I guess, to fill those in because I used to do all, tons of book uh, hauls. But so this might be the first one in a while and the last one for, for a while. But um, yeah, so I am getting a few books from the Animar series. I want to collect the whole series. There's 56 books to the series, and I know it's crazy, it's a crazy amount. And I only have a few, but um, I got books 22, 23, 25, 28, 30, 31, 32, and 37. So, yeah. Can't wait to reread those. I've been wanting to read th that series for a while. And I actually never did finish the series. I got to book, or I think I got to book like 54 or something like that. No, I mean, excuse me, book like 46. But, um, I don't know. I just, my library didn't have the next one, so. The next two I got were from, um, our by Melody Carlson. I got, um, My Son, the Savior, and it's just kind of her take on Mary's story, um, you know, Jesus' is mom, so. This sounds really interesting, so. You'll see. And it's, like, really short, too. The next one, also by Melody Carlson, is On This Day, and this one, um, it's just kind of like a, just about marriage, and, um, it's like a wedding book, and I know it's told in different perspectives, too, so, yeah. Um, the next one is actually Quidditch Through the Ages, and it's something about Quidditch, I guess, uh, from Harry Potter, so, yeah, I've been one I picked it up and grabbed it, so, yeah, on a whim, but yeah. Anyway, the next one is, the, the last one is The Summer by Sarah Dessen. This is, uh, besides her new one, this is one that I had never read by her, and, I know that this and Someone Like You was kind of combined into a movie called um, How to Deal, and I love Someone Like You. It's my favorite Sarah Dessen book, and the movie was okay. It wasn't my favorite, but I didn't hate it either. And so I'm going to see how much of the movie is like this, because it was really similar to Someone Like You. Um, thing, the thing about Sarah Dessen is that the fact that like I went through this whole stage where I want to collect all of her books, and paperback. I cannot see it in hardback, so that's why I didn't get the new book yet. I can wait until it comes out in paperback. But, but, yes, there is a but. I, lately I've been wanting to get rid of the books I have from her, and, and keep, I want to keep someone like you, but I don't know, it's just that, um, someone like you is the first book I read by her, and I freaking loved it, and I was like, oh my gosh, and... If all of her books were just as good as someone like you, I would. She would be one of my favorite authors. But I don't like any of her books besides that one. And I don't know. She's not. Um, um, she's not rememberable. I guess. Like if you ask me, what the truth about forever is about, I can't even tell you because I don't remember it. I just they're not memorable for me. And it's. I just keep reading her books, hoping that they're as good as someone like you. And I know that so many people that don't even like some, the book someone like you. So I'm like, am I the only one that likes that book? <laughs> Out of all of her ones that she's written. But I'm hoping that this one's just as good. So if not, then I'm probably not going to read her new one. I'm probably, I might get rid of her books. 
maybe I'm still thinking about it. I just, I'm just kind of disappointed. So yeah. So those were all the book, <coughs> oh, excuse me. Jeez. What the heck was that? Um, it's like my voice got caught. Um, those are all the books that I got. Yeah. So like I said, this is probably the last book haul that I'm going to do in a while. So yeah. <laughs> Bye.